the legislative explainer on reading a California bill. In the California Constitution, Article 4, Section 8B1, it says that the legislature may make no law except by statute and may enact no statute except by bill. So reading a bill requires an understanding of the component parts of a bill. In terms of a bill's anatomy, a bill contains the following major provisions, again, for a bill in the California state legislature. Legislative session at the top of assembly bills only, the language appears California legislature with the designated session like 2023, 2024 regular session, not on the top of Senate bills, however. Bill number, that follows the words assembly bill on the left-hand side or Senate bill on the right-hand side. And the assembly chief clerk or the Senate secretary assigns the bill numbers for each bill introduced in their respective houses of origin. The bill author, as well as any joint principal and co-authors are all listed. The bill author is the first line and always list the main author or authors who introduced the bill. Below the first line lists any principal co-author and the next line lists any co-author. After that is the date introduced. Note that the amendment dates are taken are placed on the top above that legislative session, uh, at least for assembly bills, and above bill numbers on the Senate side. The bill title then is after, and that's a short phrase that includes the relating clause. The title must encompass the subject matter of the bill and is not changed or amended as the bill moves forward unless the bill is, as the saying goes, gutted and amended into a different topic. The Legislative Council's digest begins uh, with a bill number, the phrase as introduced or as amended, then the bill's lead author by last name and a short phrase, the subject matter of the bill. Thereafter, the digest contains a statement of existing law, beginning generally with existing law, followed by in the next paragraph, an explanation of what the bill proposes to change in existing law and generally begins with this bill would. Following the digest are the digest keys and there are four of them. First is the vote, second, whether or not that's the vote threshold on the floor, appropriation, whether the bill appropriates money, Fiscal committee, whether under joint rule 10.5, a bill requires re-referral to the fiscal committee. And then the last one, local program, which is short for a state mandated local program. After the digest keys um, is the enacting clause. The people of the state of California do enact as follows. And then the bill text, which is the actual language of the bill. And a bill in California can amend, add or repeal sections of one or more of the 29 codes that embody all of the California statutes, numbering over 156,000 of them. And bills are divided into bill sections. At the end of the text can often be found what we call plus sections, which are provisions related not to statutory changes, but are parts of the bill, such as an urgency clause, uh, whether or not a state mandated local program is reimbursable, for example. Note that, again, before the actual text of the bill begins, it's preceded by that government code required enacting clause. So every bill in California must contain the words, the people of the state of California do enact as follows. And then at the end of the bill text appears any additional sections of the bill that provide certain required provisions. Again, those are the so-called plus sections.